We didn't turn up today. No, no, we um, obviously after Candy Island Saturday, changed the formation. Um, me and Seeks have chatted about it, said, um, should we revert back to a normal 4 4 2, try something else, or, you know, let's uh, have another go at how we played on Saturday against Candy Island, which we played very well. A great position of the ball uh, Saturday, good tempo about us, great shape about us, so we thought, hey, let's give it another 90 minutes and see if it was a one off, or perhaps we could, uh, you know, use it as a bit of a. Uh, Ammunition when we play, but um, I think if you if you're honest and say all right, it was another pre-season friendly, but there was a little bit of silverware on it. It was against our local rivals, so it was more than pre-season friendly. And to be fair, you know, you got old rounds up to and say they played off the park. To be fair, we didn't have a good shape about us. For our first ten minutes was all right, for a bit of shape um, didn't really hurt us. But um, after that, we sort of lost our way a little bit. And fair play, and I thought they played some great football. Yes, I agree with you. Um, uh, as much as it hurts me to say so, it hurts so. me to say. But when yeah. you, you know, when you're when you're playing against a side and they're knocking the ball around, their movements good as that, you've got to sometimes be big enough and man enough to hold your hands up and say fair play. Absolutely. Um, it's it's almost a case of drawing a line under tonight's performance now and, and moving on because uh, we've got and I use the word yet again, yet again another tough game um, on Saturday we're home to Dover. I was just speaking to um, Herne Bay's chairman, John Barthurst, and John tells me that it was a conscious decision um, by them to play teams that they always felt they would get a result against. So they built confidence, and that's what he feels they brought into tonight's game. They brought that winning mentality. Yeah, well, winning mentality, not many people use that word apart from me and Seeds, and we use it all the time. So, um, yeah, fair play to them. They, you know, they've done very well, and to be fair, we've played, um, apart from them, we've played three... Ryman Premier size, and you know, apart from the dart for game, we ain't done too bad. You know, we weren't great against Mason. We scored three goals, which is good, you know, for us against them. Um, but I think we just lost our way a little bit today. You know, I can't really put a finger on it. Why? You know, same personnel apart from one uh, from the starting ten on Saturday, and um, just didn't have a great shape or a little bit of meaningless about us tonight. And uh, you know, as I said to the boys before the game, you know, we're going we're gonna to stay playing the way we played Saturday. But the only way it'll carry on from Saturday is if we could keep good possession of the ball and pass it well. And realistically, we didn't. Whereas on Saturday, we did. Yes, if um, if you're right, if we'd have transposed Saturday's performance into tonight's game, um, we'd have won that two or three nil. Yeah, well, don't know about that because they had two, so I might have won it three two. <laughs> but no, um, yeah, we just you know uh, at any level of football, if you can't retain the ball and you don't pass it well and give it to the other side then they're gonna, you know, they can hurt you and we, you know, we just didn't keep the ball well enough tonight and that's, that's the pure basics of it really. Uh, exciting times now, um, one one game, or oh, sorry, two games. Two games, Thames meet Thames Thursday night, Thursday. Dover here Saturday, yeah. so um, you know. And then into league action. Into league action, you know, and the boys are dis at this point, you know, um, but I just said to them at the end of the day, you know, I'm not taking nothing away from Mumbai, the 16th of August, chips it away, three points, that's, that's our aim, that's what pre season is all about. You know, and to be fair, one of the lads said, if we play like that, we won't get three points, and you know, I won't be far wrong. But, you know, this pre season, come 16th, we'll be uh, ready to go. Good. You know, the changes all won't be there, we'll have a settled 16, ready to go, and uh, we'll be going out there with full of confidence, you know. They'll be down to the local derby, innit? I think what we've got to look forward to is uh, Herb Bay next year as well. We can put this to bed then. What, in the Bruce Smith Memorial? Yes, yeah. Yeah, obviously, because they're, yeah, they're still winning Ken League. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's only a joke. No, no, no. but uh, yeah, next year we're playing again, and you know, it's a great thing to have pre season. A little bit, yeah. of, uh, bit, bit of rivalry makes the game a little bit, uh, meaning, bit of meaning to it, but um, we won't get too down about tonight. Um, mm. We'll be putting our socks up ready to go Thursday and Saturday, and as normal against Dover, we must really come out flying and have a great game. All right. Well, thanks very much for uh, talking to me this evening, and uh, good luck in the next week. Or so. Lovely. Cheers.